Greetings everyone and welcome back to Lies of P. Just like the last episode, I am recording this episode right after I did the last one. Because I am really curious about where things are gonna go now. Since um, the fucking starting area is now fucked and filled with carcass monsters. Which are always lovely to see. I love these up carcasses. Ah, the crap got me. Ow. Ow. Ouch. Okay, but the crap is less about dealing damage to me. I think it's just about them healing themselves. Which I can live with. I know. Only you. Certainly can't get over there. What the fuck was that scream? What the fuck is going on here? Shit is absolutely fucked. Anything for me up on this terrain? Oh, but there's a chest down there. And I want that. But it's heavily guarded. Which isn't very good, however, I have my trusty scythe, which will be sure to help me. Okay, now only you remain. Oh, I fucking... I'm, I said it countless times, but I love the scythe. I love ab absolutely everything about it. What I don't love is you causing decay. Fuck. Piece of shit. Eat. Fresh. There we go. Didn't drop anything, but now we can open up that chest without anyone bothering us. Some quartz would be nice. I always appreciate quartz. Uh, quartz! Very good. Stop that, please. Actually, I'll be right back because I'm gonna do an upgrade. Now I'm ready to continue. The first thing I'm gonna do is take you out. And then I'm gonna dodge your grab. Right, perfect. Okay. Hey, you're doing some dangerous stuff there. I mean... Well, I doubt that the trains are gonna go anywhere anytime soon, so... Probably not that dangerous. And man, am I glad when I don't have to deal with fucking decay anymore. The status effect is fucking everywhere and I hate it. Okay, I can enter that train. I wonder if eventually we're gonna enter the train we started the game from. Aha. Uh -huh. Not this time, fucko. See, that's what I meant. You can hit enemies through a wall with the heavy attack of the scythe. And if that's not busted, and I don't know what is. Ow, what the fuck? Why are you so small? Are you a child? I mean, that looks like an incredibly small torso. That's a ch- Oh, that's a puppet! I see the fucking arms. A puppet infested by that carcass stuff. Oh, a new enemy. Or at least a new move I haven't seen before. Too bad that my weapon is super fucking strong. Hmm. Decay. I love the game. I do love Donkey Kong. <laughs> Away with you. Is there anything here aside from the Arago gems? Hmm. All right. So far, so good. 
more enemies. Oh no, he has a stop sign. Uh, and some tentacles growing in Europe. What it? Oh, the fucking character stuff has now started infesting puppets, so oh, that's great. It's just like the monster in the swamp. Lovely. Is that what the alchemists are doing? Putting their fucking mutant stuff into puppets? I don't even know if... The problem is I still don't know what acid is good for if my assumption is correct that fire is good against carcass enemies and blitz is good against puppets and what is acid good against maybe acid is what i need for the hybrids so the idea it seems like we're gonna have to deal with a lot of those now Oh game, if you could turn it down with the fucking decay, that would be great. Like, it wouldn't be that bad if it wouldn't fucking obliterate my weapon. Just stop standing around with that stuff. Oh, you annoying bastards. But you are relatively easily stunned, though. Just that... Every single attack of you deals CK damage. Which is super annoying. Holy shit, they're just spreading that fucking stuff everywhere. Okay, I gotta get rid of you quickly. Okay, those are some terrible enemies. Dealing with enemies that are only there to spread decay and inflict it on you is just uh, it's the definition of fun. Guy tore through my fucking pulled cells. So uh, that's lovely. Hey, no playing on the train tracks. That's dangerous, don't you know? Oh really? Decay pools? Oh my god, this area is it all. And I thought poison swamps are bad. But how about a poison swamp that not only poisons you, but also eats away at your weapon's durability? Miyazaki should hire these guys. Oh my god, this is gonna be a fucking pain. I'm gonna wait for the decay to die down. No. I'm gonna go in and... Ouch. Where's the fucking plant? It's a cost of decay. There it is. And I got inflicted again. Fucking perfect. I can already tell you what my least favorite status effect in this game is. Holy shit, decay is annoying. And I thought fucking Scarlet Rod from Elden Ring is as bad as poison could possibly get. Nope. Not if it also breaks your fucking weapons. Ah, the fuck are you? What in the flying fuck are you? Oh really, I'm stuck now? I, I can't get out, I'm stuck. I can't get out. This, this kind of sucks, thank you. Okay, um, before I deal with you, could I have a shortcut, please? That would be kind of cool. Uh oh Yeah, don't use that tail, please. Shortcut, please? Somewhere? Oh, that may be it. Of course, I've got to kill that thing, but... 
I want to refill my healing first. Come on, open a bit faster. There we go. Shortcut. Shortcut to Saga is always nice. Now I can deal with that thing. First, I'm gonna... Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna deal with it right away. Don't wanna get sidetracked. Okay. You fucking ugly bastard. Let's see if you like fire. My weapon just bonked right off of it. The fuck do you mean my weapon just bonks off of it? Oh, from its backside. That's interesting. So you got an armored ass. Ow. Fucking hell. There's a follow up? Nope. That was a nice try. Totally failed though. Oh nice, he's burning. So how about you could uh, piss off? Stop going on my nerves please, please don't press me against the wall. And there goes the burn effect. I would love for my uh, favor to charge a bit quicker. I'd also love for this guy to say her. This guy is pretty annoying. Especially since he's so fucking tanky, what's your problem? Oh, he was stuck. Yeah, I could have done some decent damage there. Oh, that's a charge. Don't wanna get hit by that. There we go. And my Sable is ready. Eh, uh, not Sable, Fable. Right, and... Oh, that kinda sucked. I should've probably hit the face. Okay, but we nearly got him. Just a matter of not fucking this up now. Come on, one more hit. There we go. A murderer puppet's amulet. Uh, increased damage inflicted on humans. On humans, you say? Probably pretty good against darker boss battles. And maybe humans are gonna be enemies we're gonna have to face more often in the future. I mean, we will definitely. Hey, I think that's the train I started in. I mean, we will probably have to face the Black uh, Rabbit Brotherhood at some point. So that amulet will be very helpful. I have perfected the greatest puppet. Now that child again. We are... Yes, behind the train car where you woke up. Is this Geppetto's tools? Uh, that's interesting. That's very interesting. Hmm. Letter from someone who has gone ahead. Dear Geppetto's puppet, that's me, who will come to this workshop train. I'm really thankful to you. A workshop train hidden by Geppetto, isn't that something? If not you, how would I have found this place? Unfortunately for Geppetto, I have the ability to read someone's memories. In Malum district, I had lunch. They thought that they followed you. Uh, that, uh, they thought that if they followed you, Geppetto's puppet, they'd find the relic he stole. And that hunch was right. Uh, the relic has been returned to a sacred place. Now that the stage is set, the doors will open. I know all this is confusing, but soon you'll learn everything. Thank you, you were a good guide. SM. Uh, let me guess, Simon... 
something. I can't remember his last name. Probably Simon. And a LADA break cartridge. More physical damage reduction, yes please. Okay, cool secret we found here. Probably something easily missable. But not for me and my keen eyes. I would never miss something ever in my entire life. Okay, that's where I came from. Yeah, there's the fucking decay fog. Only way to go is up there. And then down those stairs. Cause, yep. That's a shortcut I unlocked. I'm gonna refill my healing. Since the stargazer is right around the fucking corner, I mean, why not? You don't follow me, do you? Nah, he doesn't. He's a good boy. Okay, I can go into that train. But I can also... Go out there. More puppets. You see, I, I wouldn't have seen the one hiding behind that. Behind those lug... Oh my fucking god. Oh my, what? Uh, excuse me. I'm just gonna grab myself this uh, treasure that I'm out of here. Yep, um. Master Chef's knife. Oh boy, I found Gordon Ramsay's weapon. Cool. Uh, I know there was a collapse, but why did I have to cut off communication? Please let us out. Man, this game is... This game is taking on some horror shades and I like it. This makes sense, horror shades. I know it's leaning a bit into the horror aspect of things. And boy, I'd, I'd love it if they go completely off the rails with that. If they just go full on horror now. Are you follow me? That's super cool. Totally want to deal with you tanky fucks. Hey, nice try. Too bad you suck. Hi. You luck, little lamb. Hand over all you got. Um could not not now. Oh, why do these babies have to follow me all Yeah, yeah. I mean, sure. <laughs> that works. Yeah. So, um, what are you guys up to? Oh my god. They're taking her apart. Ha! <laughs> this is... Well, it seems like the babies were useful after all. No, don't go away. Keep on attacking her. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> oh, they're doing some good damage for I have to fight her. I'm just gonna stick back and watch this. Uh huh. Sure. The babies are doing a fantastic job. Uh, baby's dead. Oh wait, she's still she's still going after the baby, which means I can do this. Oh, I feel kinda dirty, but it also feels so good. 
Okay, don't dodge my stuff, please. Ouch. Okay, just you and me now. <laughs> Too bad you're an NPC enemy, which means I can easily exploit your backside. That, that sounds kind of wrong, but you know what I mean. Yeah, I'm sorry, but... Nah. You surviving, that's just not meant to happen. Ouch. Okay, maybe you are not as weak as I assumed. We're just unfortunate enough to um, be swamped by an army of killer babies. Okay, one more. One more backstab will seal the deal. Aww. I nearly had it. Come on, do your red attack again. Because that leaves you wide open. Oh, that. And come on. Now. And come on. Dead. Well, you should have thought about that before you attacked me. Maybe I could have told you like, hey, I know this place, that hotel where survivors can chill and hang out together. But no, you resorted to violence. And so I, I just defended myself. Your death is your own fault. Hello. So we're basically going through the tutorial again. But a fucked up version of said tutorial. That eh, was a nice try. Honestly, kind of curious how that didn't hit me. Not that I'm complaining though. Oh, you're one of those guys. Hold on. Ow. Can't let you do that. There we go. There's a stargazer down there. I fear that there may be a boss fight nearby. Okay, you seemed a bit more intimidating than you actually were. I mean, you just guarded, guarded a favor catalyst, so... Hmm, not what I expected. Oh, there's a butterfly somewhere. There it is, a golden one. Ouch, I keep on forgetting that they can attack. The stabilized alchemist booster. Hmm, kind of worthless, I'm gonna be honest, because I rarely use the gold coin fruits and the wish stones. Some cat dust. Do I want to know what cat dust is? Probably not. Oh, how did that miss? Come on. Okay. Anything cool in here? Toilets. Toilets are pretty cool, I guess. Ouch. Fuck off. Come on. A dark moonstone of the covenant. I'd, I'd really love the next variant of the... Of these things, you know. It's been a while since I uh, last upgraded my weapon. Is this gonna lead to a boss fight? I don't wanna accidentally stumble into a boss fight, I'm gonna be honest. Hmm. I'm uncertain. I mean, I don't see a summoning pool around. And there's enemies out there. Yeah, that's not a boss fight. That's not a boss fight. That's completely 100. There's a Trinity door. 
Huh, I assume there's just three of the uh, of those things because you know Trinity three, you know? Seems like I was wrong. I'm a big fucking fan of the concept that a starting area or the starting area in this case turns into an endgame area later on. Which also happened in Bloodborne. And I already liked it there and here it's just as cool. And even a bit more fleshed out than it was a platform. At least it feels like that's the case. Now I have a feeling. I have a feeling that I know where the next boss is gonna be. Because I'm fairly certain that the arena where we fought against the festival master. Or the parade guy. So we're gonna now face our next boss. Maybe even. No, no, I don't wanna do that. Maybe even a corrupted version of the parade guy. Since our last boss was a corrupted version of the police guy. Ah, shit. Yeah, those guys, with the reach of the scythe, no big deal. I saw that. Yeah, so... No, I Never mind, I didn't fuck it up. Okay. Oh, I love the scythe so much, I'm gonna keep on repeating it. But it's just it's such a great weapon. I'm a big fan of scythes. Oh, even the dogs, really. And it makes me happy to see that the scythe in this game is such a good weapon. Oh wait, that's a real... Is that a puppet? No, that's not a puppet, that's a real dog. I think. No, oh, That sucks. Uh, I don't like what I'm hearing back there. Okay, you have a stupid amount of poise. Jesus Christ, that hyper armor. Good thing it didn't manage to inflict me with decay. That would have sucked. Anything back there that I missed? Uh, doesn't seem like it. To listen to those noises. Hey, why can't I hit you? There we go. You have a stupid amount of HP, what the fuck? You also got some spider legs growing out of your face. Oh, I love everything about this weapon. Wait, why couldn't I... ...do the fucking thing on you? I keep my distance. That seemed like a grab. But not with me. Grab someone else, you fucking weirdo. Got a treasure chest with a coil a Mjolnir head. Or a coil Mjolnir. That sounds cool. Fucking mechanical hammer. I see that dog up there and it looks like it's going to explode if it gets near me. I mean at this point why should I use any other attack? Hey doggy. I'm gonna assume that you are or once were a dog at least. Maybe these guys were humans once. Who knows? Well, now they're not my problem anymore. There's one more item. More enemies. Also, is it just me or is Pinocchio making more noises? 
I feel like as the game went on, Pinocchio started making more noises, like grunts, gasps, noises of pain when he gets hit. Maybe that's something with him slowly becoming a human. No, I didn't get my back seven. That sucks. That kinda sucks. Oh, those noises concern me. Thanks for leaving a decay pool behind us all. The fuck are you doing, huh? Okay, you're just luckily not one of those guys that spread decay all over the place. I I mean, come on. You see how s yourself how good this weapon is. God, kind of nice carry in. Ouch. I don't see anything because I'm pressed against the wall. Yeah, that didn't quite reach. That did though. Ouch. Ah, fuck. Would you please stagger? Okay, maybe for you to stagger I should actually start hitting you. Oh well. I hope that some of these enemies don't respawn because that would make this area absolute hell. I'm not gonna question how that didn't hit me. Alright, a legion plug. I do actually need one of those to craft uh, the last arm. And thanks for opening the way to a stargazer for me. Okay, let's see what we got out there. I knew it. Fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, shame on me. Which is why I'm not gonna let that happen. Okay, I'm kind of scared that I'm already approaching the next boss. And judging by the enemies around here, it's probably gonna be a boss that... It's gonna f inflict a lot of decay. My absolute favorite status effect, hello. I don't suppose you'd like to buy anything. Sorry, I've been on my own so long, my sales pitch is a little rusty. Hard to engage in trade when you're fleeing from monsters. Yeah, I got that. Even if the abnormal has become normal, the living must live. Buy something and you'll help both of us. Fair argument, a shovel. A military shovel. I have to. <laughs> How could I not? L A D A. The? And they all kind of suck when it comes to physical defense. And I'm gonna buy them anyways. Let's see. Should have enough to buy both. Buy some. Yep. Perfect. Fairy tale of the three brothers of the workshop tower. The first part is torn off. Thus, there lived in Krat a technician who made the friendly three puppet bra- Do I have to fight a trio boss? <sighs> An alchemist who breathed life into puppets and a stalker who rectified puppets gone wrong. The three brothers built the craftsman's workshop tower and made phenomenal, phenomenal puppets. The puppets seemed as if they're alive. The good ones helped the people of Krat and worked hard, danced and sang songs. The people were extremely glad and everyone was happy. They said it's all thanks to the three brothers. The three good brothers lived happily ever after. And now I'm probably gonna have to fight them. I, I'm not gonna... I'm not walking into a boss now, do, am I? 
please, no, 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 no boss fight. What the fuck? I mean, I guess this doesn't look like a boss fight. Collapsing crowd. Damn! <laughs> Lover's letter to, to my beloved Gideon. The world is dying. I hear news of the epidemic dozens of times a day. If, on top of this, I am not able to see you, I may suffocate and die. I'll wait for you at the sign tonight, as usual. Don't be late, my love. What sign? Are you the one who wrote that letter? Are you looking for Gideon? Uh... Oh boy. Hey, 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 hey. Not nice. Okay, you look way tankier than you actually are. Not complaining though. Alright, so. It seems like this is what we're gonna go through in the next episode. I am incredibly excited. As always, I hope you all enjoy. It. I mean, is, hold on, is that Golden Ergo? I could have just waited a bit longer, then went here to get my golden egg. I didn't have to fight that green spawn monster. Fucking hell. <laughs> Anyways. As always, I hope you all enjoyed. I hope you have or had a great day. And I will see you all in the next one. Goodbye. <laughs>